Hey DIYers, Mike Borders with the Mike Borders channel. Thank you for watching. Today we're working on our Whirlpool freezer and we're going to show you how to replace your light bulbs. Let's get started. All right, YouTubers in the kitchen now, we are working on a Whirlpool refrigerator, a side-by-side, -side, nothing fancy, pretty basic. I'm guessing this is about five to seven years old. The light up top still works good. However, the bottom portion of the freezer is dim and we did some investigating and let me remove this real quick. And right there you have a plastic case and behind that case is your light bulb and that plastic case is very important because it protects the light bulb as you pull food in and out of this freezer. There's two clips on the left side, one clip on the right hand side. Be very careful, this is plastic. You just want to carefully pull and compress the clips, pull this out, set it in a safe location and go ahead and take the bulb out. Ooh, it's cold. That means it's been burnt out for a long time. Ooh, that's very cold. And this is a 40 watt bulb. At this point, I've got the old bulb in a plastic bag. I'll head to my local hardware store and purchase new bulbs. All right, YouTubers, we are back from our local Lowe's and we purchased brand new LED bulbs because those old condescent bulbs, they're energy eating bulbs and they take up a lot of energy. The new LED bulbs are very efficient and this is an 11 watt replacement bulb. However, the output is only two watts. So I bought two of them because there is two light bulbs in our freezer and I made sure I bought the refrigerator or appliance light bulbs because they are going to be able to withstand the cold temperatures inside the freezer. And as far as the lumens, 180 per bulb. And as you can see the design with the LED and again, two watt output. So that's four watt output total with both bulbs inside. The old bulbs were giving off 80 watts. So we're gonna save some money. Let's go ahead and open them and install them. Bulb is now out of the package. Back to the refrigerator. Do your best not to drop the bulb. Just align the thread back into the socket. And if it does not go in smoothly, back it out and reinsert it. This one's going in very smoothly. And go ahead and tighten it, not too tight. And there it is, wow, that's really nice and here's the plastic protective shield that protects the light bulb as I mentioned two clips on the left hand side one clip on the right and this should be fairly friendly what I want to do is insert the right prong first and then insert the left prongs and that is in and secure it's pretty bright it's actually brighter than that one up top. So what I'm going to do, remove all that and insert the LED bulb. Making progress, removed everything. And this protective shield is a little different. It goes the full length from left to right and two prongs on each side. You just wanna be careful as you remove these. Again, it is plastic. You do not wanna break anything. And what I'm going to do is just lower each side and I can gain access to the bulb itself to unscrew it. Again, as you shift that protective shield, do your best not to break those lower tabs. And this bulb still works. However, incandescent and an energy eating bulb. With the new bulb in hand, again, very important, do not cross thread it. Insert it and it should twist in extremely smoothly. And once I'm done there, I'll just carefully shift this back up into the little side slots that they go into and just like that and that is secured everything's back inside the freezer do your best not to forget any food out that would not be good as far as the old bulbs i put them in the package that the new led bulbs came in and what i'll do is next time i go into my local lows they actually have a box or trash that is specifically for used up and burnt out light bulbs. So throw these away responsibly, that would be good. Hopefully this helps. As you can see, this went extremely fast and friendly. Do us a favor below the video, you will see that thumbs up icon. Click on that, like the video, subscribe to the channel. Definitely go to your settings, turn on your YouTube notification bell. Once you do that, every video that we upload, you will be notified, you will be able to stay up to date with us and that will be awesome. Also, one more thing, we replaced light bulbs in our refrigerator portion. So if you're interested in that, we took out those condescent energy eating bulbs and put in brand new LED bulbs. We will post a link in the description and comment section below. So definitely check that out.